All right, I don't think I'm going to find any rocket launchers in here. Probably. No, no guarantees, though. I mean, there could be one hidden, but probably not. I wonder how long this is. Oh, wait, there's, there's a turret. That works, too. Okay, don't shoot me in the face. Kind of rude. Hey, here, drone. Okay, fine. Drone. That drone took quite a bit of damage. Get out of here, helicopter. Yeah, you run away. Is there? <laughs> there's random guys over there. I don't... No, there's another drone. I can't hit him. These drones, man. Hate the drones. They really want to shoot me. And they're fairly accurate. See how accurate I am. Is that hitting him? I want to believe it is. He ran. I'd be doing something. Hmm. I guess I could just jump in the dumpster. Yeah, that probably worked. Probably. Should be a little easier getting back now there's no helicopter. Man, that guy really wants to shoot me. He's being very loud about it. One box with one medkit. Thank you. What are these statues of? Uh, I guess that that's Breen in his weird suit, perhaps. I ain't try it. Now there's no helicopter. I've got all the time in the world to shoot you in the face. Just more trucks. DD. World's tiniest balcony. Where am I? I guess I'm headed to Eli's, right? Is there going to be a boat section? Or did the beta have a boat? I don't, I don't know what was in the beta. I've never actually seen the beta, so I don't, I don't know what was in it. I mean, I don't seem to be getting any closer to like Black Mesa East. I think I'd be leaving the city. I am very much so not leaving the city. Maybe, maybe Eli is hiding in the Citadel. The perfect place they never think to check there. Oh, there he is. There he is. You can try it. It's not gonna work. Mm, I think that's about it down here. Uh, these seems like fake doors. Oh, there's there's a computer. They have a button. Here, a whole bunch of batteries. Ammo for that Magnum that I never picked up. There we go. That will open the door. Can I come back through this way, though? I, I'm getting real close to that Citadel. Uh, oh, I do have a grenade. I don't know if this is effective. Oh, I can't. That's odd. I couldn't, uh, I couldn't stand up while holding the grenade. Like, you can't stand up when using grenades. That or I'm getting stuck on the wall, man. I'm getting stuck on the wall, that's it. Like, that doesn't make any sense why I was, like, getting stuck while holding a grenade. Eh, whatever. Get behind him. Eh, there's drones. Oh, you're not dead. Anyone gonna come up behind us? Half-Life likes to do that with uh, enemies showing up right after you get past the turrets. That way you got an excuse to also use the turrets. Oh, uh, well. <laughs> There's just a bunch of guards. Ooh. I forgot the uh, machine gun works two ways. It's also very strong against me. Just chuck grenades. Something's gotta hit. I that bounced off his head. Come on. Oh, I got him with that one, though. Some of these grenades work out. 
timing's a little off. Do I have any, uh, I do have a grenade left. I just chuck it in the entrance. Uh, I maybe got him a little bit. It's just a little bit. There's another box over here. Very helpful, these boxes. Yep, yep, they definitely did not make it. Okay, another loading screen. That's not a surprise. It seems like a pretty obvious little loading area. An airlock of sorts. Half-Life loves its airlocks. But uh, I, I just seem to be getting closer and closer to that citadel. I'm not entirely sure where I'm headed. Uh, this kind of looks like a subway station. A little bit at least. There's boxes everywhere. Ladders. I, I could go down there. Do I want... There is ammo and health down there. Might as well grab that. Thank you. Tiny boxes. You got anything for me? They had nothing. Very disappointed in you tiny boxes. What in the world is this? It is light. It's really, really odd. There's a ladder over here. There's ladders everywhere. I, I want I want this crate, please. Thank you. It was just more ammo. I don't need more ammo. I've got infinite ammo. Everyone drops ammo when they die. Run like weird TV land or something. Right next to the Seven Up. <laughs> they just they replaced the uh, the one one or seventeen up with Propsy. And they just didn't take this with them. I don't know why, they just didn't. I think I have Propsy, please. One Propsy. Coming right up. Hide it in the corner. There's actually 1,700 cans back there. It's a common place to leave them. Oop. Man hacks. What are you doing here? Do uh, the combine usually just leave man hacks running? Surely they're on like a battery. They, they can't last forever. Hmm. Still don't really know where I am. I, I, I can only assume I'm in the Citadel? That was worth a shot. I generally shoot the cameras, just in case. Hey, this is like the first health station we've seen. I mean, I guess if you don't count the uh, tutorial one. I don't... Do, uh, do Combine usually get a use to Manhex? I didn't think they could spawn to. Granted... Combine never really lasts long enough to do that normally. Take a little bit of that HEV juice. 25 of it. Okay. I have no idea how much is in this one. This one I can kind of get, but I don't know about the medkit one. How did you just finally find me after the gun battle? There's another one. Hey, stuck on the floor. More batteries. Is there another combine, dude? There's another medkit station. I don't need another one. <laughs> is this one broken? What is this? They all just say purge. Very, very odd. Hmm. Well, um, hmm. I guess I'll go through the vents. I don't know if this is the way to go or not. This could be secrets. Oh, it's secrets. Thank you for the secrets. I just wish I had that secret magnum so I could <laughs> use all this magnum ammo I picked up. Maybe one day we'll find the magnum. That is cops. I kind of feel like I should be fighting uh, not cops at this point. Like the... Uh, Military version? When, when I'm in there's like structures, I don't know. I feel like it shouldn't be civil protection. It should be the the troops. It feels weird that it's just cops and I have a machine gun. 
Like, very rarely did the cops themselves have machine... Well, I guess towards the end of Water Hazard. Most of them had machine guns. And then you weren't really any, in any uh, major combine facility. Mostly like random warehouses. So I guess it would be a bit early to see combine soldiers considering they don't show up until like, I wanna say you don't, do you see one? I guess there's technically one out of bounds in like the very beginning of the sewer section in uh in half-life 2 he, he's out of bounds and like on top of a roof that you can't see it may just he may be dead too it's been so long since i've looked at that other than that i don't think you see any uh troopers until they raid black mesa i don't think so at least there's a random dude here where are we? I thought we were in like a subway station, but that doesn't seem to be the case. Later. I'm, I'm going in the tunnels again. Gordon loves his tunnels. What is down here? A bunch of boxes. I don't know who's been putting these boxes in this tunnel. Someone has. Paint can. Oh, hello. Right in the crotch. Can't reach it, it's too high. Rude. Oh, this is like a different gun. A different, way more accurate gun. I like this one better. Please replace all of your turrets with this one. I like this gun. Look at this gun. Look how nice it looks. I'm a big fan of this gun. I, I want to rip it off and take it with me. I think Half-Life could do with an LMG, right? That guy's still alive? No, he died. I had to make sure. Go there, or we can just go through Barrel Land. Barrel Land, what do you got for me? I like a... I was going to say Playground, but that would, inc <laughs> that would involve Playground equipment somewhere. Is that a real door? It's, it's a real door, but it doesn't open. Ooh, I go straight down. I break my legs. That kind of looked like a cool robot from the back, but it's, it's just a light. Now I'm disappointed. I wanted a cool robot. Well, we're definitely deeper in some sort of... Oh, he's got a stun stick. We're getting deeper in the combine something. I just don't know what. Oh, this one's got tons of juice in it. Look at all that juice. It had like 75 juice. Turns out this, uh, the, the beta actually just skips direct, like, it skips everything. We head directly to uh, the Citadel. There is no Black Mesa East or Ravenholm or Water Hazard or anything. Straight to the final boss battle. Jordan is not gonna take his time. He, he's got, he's been gone for 10 years. He's not waiting any longer. He's going directly for Breen's head. Why would that turn the alarm on? I'm not sure if I want an alarm to sound. Okay, this isn't even the way to go. Is there a different door? Uh, oh yeah, yeah. Wow, that is slow. Very, very slow. We haven't seen anyone but Combine, right? I was about to say that, and I was like, you know what? this kind of feels like zombies. Anyone else think this feels like zombies? Get that machine gun. Got zombies in here. I th is that the zombie sound? I'm pretty sure that's the, uh, the Half-Life 1 zombie sound. It could be, uh, I don't think it's Vortigaunt's. Pretty sure that's Half-Life 1 zombie noises before they started screaming about painful death all the time. Does Gordon have any idea where he's headed? Because <laughs> I certainly don't. We're just crawling through random vents at this point. 
Oh yeah, there's definitely headcrabs. That's headcrab noises. Cause like in, even in Half-Life 2, you, you do walk through a lot of random stuff. Random directions. But every now and then there's an NPC going like, oh yeah, you're going the right way. Just keep going and you'll you'll hit to X or to Y. Now I'm just I'm just going somewhere. Is this the, the regular way that uh Barney was talking about when he wanted me to head to Eli's lab? Like, oh yeah, just gotta have to walk on foot. That involves going to the Citadel and then underneath it to old New York, apparently. There's a wall here, please, please. Just a, oh, there's a giant invisible wall right here. Okay, where, um, I'm just gonna, oh, that's where it ends. Right in the sky there. Can I get in here? Thank you. I want out of this nightmare. I wonder if, he's, if there could be ant lions. Hey, zombies! Now I just need a shotgun. I have been missing the zombies. Come on, get me the, the old stun stick. My, what is happening? The floor's a bit electrified now. Don't worry about it. That's normal. Have you been eating your bones? He's been eating his pelvises. He needs those. Whack that zombie. Gotcha. Are we in a hospital? Very odd, like, just set of areas. That guy took a ton of damage. Then we can go up, and it's all blocked off. So can't go up. We can't even go over there. Uh, random beams in the walls? What have the combine been? He he wants that camera. I guess you do see. I was gonna say, do we ever see uh, zombies attack cameras? Uh, this is telling a turret. It was making a turret noise. And technically, episode one, you do see that. And this is too small to fit through. So I I guess. Zombies would try to attack cameras? Oh, this looks nice. It's leaking from a big old pipe up there. There's Zombabados. The intercom works down here, too. Get up there. Thank you. I, I assume that's what I was supposed to do. Let's go up to that. Gnome Boy. My favorite. I mean, I'm supposed to go through that door. Or not. Maybe I'm supposed to go down there now? No, boy. Check if it's safe. Yeah, it's not really safe down there. Well, right, I'll fix that. Hey, there we go. It's not often grenades work out. Okay, there's a random bomb somewhere. It's not often grenades work out in Half-Life games. They tend to be uh, fairly useless. I think no boy's gone. He fought the good fight. Now he's gone. Ah, uh, fast head crabs. Didn't think we'd be seeing these. At least not this early. Yeah, I'm behind the. Uh, do these? They do punch these. I'm curious if they would punch item crates. What is happening in here, please? Thank you. Oh, that one's got bullets. I didn't think you'd ever have ones that had bullets. Do you? I don't think you actually even see turrets with bullets, do you? In uh, in regular Half-Life, they're always out of bullets. And maybe I do recall being able to put them up. Do you, do you see some in like Eps or the first or just Half-Life Two, like when you're fighting through the library sort of area, maybe? Where do you see ceiling turrets that actually have bullets? I don't remember. Clearly they're not a threat because I don't remember them. <laughs> if they were, uh, they were a big threat, I'd probably go like, Oh yeah, I remember hating those things. Hey, come back here. Okay, so here's the plan. He's gone. I'm going to cover the entirety of the exit with trip mines. So when he comes back from turning the power on, he'll get his. He's down here getting a... Ice cold. 
nulled, apparently. Yeah, yeah, he's uh, he's still going up. Don't think I can call the elevator back. I left you guys down by yourself with the beers. That guy was just—he just wanted to check on his friends. <laughs> We're actually gonna turn the power off, or not? That's worth a shot, or you know, like 17 of them. Warning, moving parts can crush and cut. Keep hands and objects away at all times. It'd be a real shame if someone, <laughs> if someone shoved some pliers in there. See that? That right there? Very helpful sign. Very helpful. Now as to what that did. Oh, yeah, the floor is no longer lava. I'll open that door. Thank you. Please. So you guys just... Play with the zombies down here? Is that worth it? Um, I did technically gain two more bullets from that. Oop, nope, not dead. <laughs> Neither of them died from that. What is that noise? Oh! Always gotta pay attention to the noise. First you man hacks. And my slightly slower firing rate. Gotcha. There's more. Don't do it. Okay. No more man hacks. Let us uh, ascend out of this nightmare. There's more. No man hacks. Get out of here. I decided to go into the smelly part and leave. Hey, that's the end. Okay. So, it, I assume that would lead into water hazard. Rook, what is? I don't remember what the names of Half Life chapters are called. I I assume this will lead into Boatland. I only say that based on the fact that I ended the demo in water. Surely that has to lead into Boatland. Surely. So that's a ton of credits, by the way. I do kind of wish the voice acting mentioned who they were voice acting. How am I supposed to know? Hmm. We did, we never did find the Magnum. We found Magnum ammo. We did technically find the Magnum, but I never had access to it. We never did fight that uh, cremator. I wonder if it's killable. Hmm. Flare gun model? We didn't see a Annabelle model, flare gun model. We never see, saw any of this stuff. Hmm. All right, so we're back. Credits are over, and I have maybe used some cheat codes. I was curious. I want to see the other guns. Uh, there's a reason most of them aren't in here, and, uh, well, you can probably see why they're not in here. But there, there are a ton of guns. Like, a, a lot. <laughs> Just a, a whole lot. Most of them you can't see anything. Like, ice, ice axe. Can't, can't really see much. It does work very quickly, though. Let's see, we have the ice axe. Uh, physics cannon. Yep, physics cannon. Very effective. <laughs> uh, we have the towel cannon. No, no sound effects for this one though. Does work. The tiny gun, the magnum we never got. We could get the magnum. Look at that. See that nice sound effects we got here on this magnum. Can't, still can't kill civilians. Still can't do that. We do have the nice magnum. See, look, I, I'm saving the random civilians. How nice of me. Man, I really wanted to get this gun. Like, look how, like, the look, the sound. Oh, it's divine. Absolutely divine. I just wish I could have... Wow, there are a ton of people still in line. You'll have to wait your turn like everybody else. Uh, I don't actually have to. I know how to use cheat codes. <laughs> Foolish mortals. Let's see. Alex's gun. It does, in fact, work. Just on access, access to it. Flare gun. Hey, look at that. Flares. Can I kill, can I kill someone with this flare gun? 
Ooh, look at them dance. There we go. Uh, the regular machine gun, we had that. MPK-5. Sound effects work. AKM. No sound effects. Um, the Overwatch rifle, we never found this, but that's just Half-Life 2. Uh, let's see, GR9. That sounds like an LMG. I want this gun. I can't see it, but I want this gun. Sposs? It's, <laughs> it shoots three shots at a time. Oh, no, it's like fully automatic. Wait, I need, I need some enemies to shoot at real quick. Loading the screen, hit me up. I don't know where that uh, cremator went, so I was I was gonna try and run to the cremator as we shoot people with this nice nice guns we got here. Yeah, you gotta examine the guns. You never know. You gotta take back the streets one gun at a time. Okay, that one just shot every single bolt at the same time. Uh, let's see, Annabelle. It's odd that Annabelle doesn't show itself, considering it was in the credits. Steam propelled rebar launcher. I mean, it works. Sniper rifle. <laughs> All the kickback on that thing. Yeah, what was this even about? Grenades. Rocket launcher. Uh, of course, the Pharopod. The squeaky toy of Half-Life 2. Hope you enjoy being squeaked. The fire extinguisher. Doesn't seem to do much. Combine guard gun. Just uh, just hold hold on here. We gotta wait for whatever this is to happen. Just throw this into you know third person. There we go. Ah, oh well, there's what the combine guard gun looks like. It's odd. Is that the combine guard gun? Or is that just my model? No, that's the gun. There's no first person for it though. So what are we? What are we doing here? I'm oh, fine. Yeah, yeah, I don't know what that does, but it, uh, it's very effective. Very, very effective. Let's see, we also have emulator. Oh, that must be the flamethrower. It doesn't really emulate so much as it just destroys. But, you know, I, I didn't miss a, the what, blue on gun. Wait, wait, fire extinguisher, fire extinguisher. Hey, there's a fire extinguisher. Okay, we'll immolate. Fire extinguisher. No. Either die too fast or it just doesn't work. Let's see, all these guards over here. What about you? You feel your secrets, guards. You real? Ooh, they're all real, too. That must be, uh, it's gotta be one of these guns. I don't know which one it is. It's one of them. I didn't even see this. Look at that, dude. Look at this absolute beast of a dude. And they're taking pictures of me. How rude. How rude. Maybe you enjoy the uh, the Spas 12 with his infinite bullets. It just shoots so quickly. So very quickly. Wow, there are really a lot of guys in this tunnel. I didn't realize this. It's neat that they're all real people, too. Uh, let's see, emulator. Is the emulator in this map? Let's get rid of that. Random guards there. Random guard here. Where was the, uh, where's the exit to this map? Through this tunnel? Probably. Oh, yeah, then we went up. And we went through random hallways. Not this way, though. Up the elevator. Or down the elevator? Did, did we go down the elevator? Maybe we went no, I don't, I don't think we went down the elevator, did we? Maybe we did. It's, it's, a, it's a confusing nightmare, this map. Yeah, we went down, and then we ended up here. Then I go left through this alleyway to the plaza exit. We're going to get to that emulator guy. We're going to find out if he is, in fact, killable. Very, very curious. Is any right here? Like, we're in the trash. Maybe getting close. Yeah, there he is. Let's put that back into first person. There we go. Hello, emulator guy. Will this kill me? Um, I don't, I don't think so. He does at least take damage, or you know, 
You can shoot it. Oh, you can totally kill him. That's great. His face is terrifying. But you can totally kill that guy. Anything else interesting in this map? I think that's that's probably about it. I mean, we got all these random civilians that are going to get shot, maybe. I go around shoot. Don't worry, I will avenge you. Where is he going? Running away from me. Well, let's just get out the old uh, combine guard gun. It's in no way overpowered. Well, that was uh, a little more disappointing than I thought it would be.